They do come back. Well, here's a look at Patrick Chan backstage. The men's champion will skate next when championship figure skating on CBC presented by Artistry Skincare and Cosmetics returns. Beijing is one of the four great ancient capitals of China. It is recognized as the cultural center of the nation and the city hosted the Cup of China earlier this season and is hosting today's Grand Prix final gala performance. Well, here's how the men's race broke down. Toronto's Patrick Chan won the competition. Nobunari Oda was second and his Japanese teammate Takahiko Kazuka won the bronze. Here is Patrick Chan with our Scott Russell. Here's Patrick Chan of Canada, the Grand Prix final champion. I heard it said after Skate Canada, and you said it on the way to the Cup of Russia, that I'm not such a great traveler. Have you overcome that a little bit? I think so. I think this is proof that I have overcome it a little bit. Um, I don't have the best track record overseas. I don't do the best uh, in competitions overseas. But I think I, I really learned from a lot of um, trainers, previous athletes you know what they did to see what to keep keep themselves busy during the flight the long flight so you know I would get up a lot uh, during the flight and drink a lots of water so that's that seemed to help so I'm gonna stick to that and, and uh, use that to when I go to Tokyo. China is the country of your ancestry you had never been here before why was it important to come and perform well? Mm -hmm. Um, China, I haven't been here, this is my first time. I've been to many countries in Asia except China. China's the last one, so uh, it meant a lot for me to be here. I have lots of family that used to live here, and my parents both were born here, so it means a lot to do well here especially. So I'm so glad that I got to meet a lot of the Chinese volunteers, the Chinese skaters, and uh, the Chinese people, and, and really enjoy the food. Um, the food is pretty good. It's almost better than the food in Toronto, the Chinese food in Toronto. So it's a good, good comparison, but I felt really comfortable here, and I can't wait to come back. Happy New Year, Patrick. Thanks.